COVID-19, a major pandemic reaching global proportions and affecting millions, all due to a microscopic pathogen, a virus. Viruses are vessels of parasitic genetic material that rely on our cells in order to infect, replicate, and spread. Many are pathogenic or bad and cause widespread disease, the kind that can keep us home and having to meet virtually. But what if I told you not all viruses are bad? In fact, what if a virus could actually be medicinal or therapeutic, perhaps even to fight cancer? Well, today I will be introducing you to one of those viruses and my research topic, Vaccinia virus. So what makes Vaccinia a good virus? Well, its genetic material is DNA, and it's relatively easy to alter in a lab, creating a safe virus that does not cause its natural disease. And interestingly, it has a tendency to replicate in and subsequently kill cancer cells. So how do we capitalize on all this potential? Well, if we consider cancer, we have to note that cancer cells are chaotic and don't follow the same restraints our healthy cells do, and they are incredibly good at hiding their disorder, often going unnoticed by our body's defenses. Usually, our immune system, which protects us from infection, is also able to recognize cancer cells as being sick and needing to be destroyed. Cancer cells, however, have developed ways of putting on a disguise such that our immune cells can no longer see them, allowing them to survive and ultimately cause serious disease. So how do we ensure cancer cells can't hide from our immune system? Well, imagine this. A masked robber is holding up a bank, but how will they be brought to justice when their face is covered? A vigilante. He springs into action, roping up the robber and ripping off his mask, revealing his identity. The vigilante can then alert the authorities, and when the police arrive, they can now easily identify the robber out of his disguise. The police can then escort the robber to a cold, dark jail cell. Now, this may seem like a movie plot. It's actually quite similar to what our therapeutic vaccine virus does when it infects a cancer cell. Therefore, my thesis is focused on developing a DNA-altered vaccine virus to infect cancer cells and reveal them to the immune system so that they can be destroyed. I have been able to create a virus that can perform this task and have shown in doing so the killer immune cells that interact with vaccine infected cancer cells are able to become activated and primed for killing. My next step is to assess their killing ability and to test this virus in mice to understand if we can see the same results in the complex environment of a tumor. Understanding how a virus can be a vessel to reveal cancer cells or even produce other proteins such as those on the COVID-19 virus to create a vaccine as an important step towards safe therapeutics and preventative medicine, all by unmasking one bad guy at a time. Thank you.